will do hari om meditation you know when you step on a thorn or a stone what is the sound that comes of you ha that ha indication of pain and where that sensation comes in the navel stomach lower region and when you are astonished what is the sound that comes out of you oh oh ho 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 where is the sound ho comes huh let's see ho ho oh ho <laughs> oh ho where does it come chest region na and if something is simply great wonderful what is this mm where does it come mm so ha ho mm where does the prana moves in different places no huh? right you know there is a point in our head where all the five senses meet you know where is it the center of the skull that is where re it's above the palate re you say re 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 that area where all the, like the eyes nose Yes if you draw a line it's a point that everything meets that's where re comes re ha means the the pain and suffering re is the remover that which removes so we need to transform the ha into re that is hari hari means one who removes all the pain and sufferings yeah what removes pain and suffering not somebody sitting somewhere in the heaven it is the prana it is the energy in us that will remove all the pain and suffering so we'll raise the prana the ha prana into a re om re om prana okay so we will do that we have seven centers in our body the first center is at the base of the spine this is the center where when energy manifests either as the energy in the first center manifests as inertia or enthusiasm the same energy moves the sex center is the second center where it manifests as sex energy or creative energy creativity and sex come from the same center swadishtan chak just 4 inches above the base of the spine and 4 inches below the navel and the navel the third center navel center in which our emotions manifest in four different forms what are those forms as jealousy generosity greed and joy two positive two negative emotions they manifest in the navel the same energy moves in the chest region manifests itself as love fear and hatred and from the same from the heart center we move to the throat the throat it manifests as gratefulness and grief if you are sad what happens the throat chokes if you are grateful then also throat chokes same energy in between the eyebrows as anger and alertness and then you go to the top of the head the same energy manifests as bliss hmm. now there are two things one is imagination another is visualization so visualization is you try to see things if i say apple so what type of apple how big it is how small what color it is and try to see it you don't need to do that no effort to be involved in meditation secret of meditation is what no effort that is imagination 
एन इमेजिनेशन इज जस्ट थिंक अबाउट इट इन ए वेरी लाइट मैन एंड देन लेटिंग गो नॉट ट्राइंग टू सी इट नॉट ट्राइंग टू विजुअलाइज इट ओके सो वी विल डू दिस हरि ओम मेडिटेशन Today we'll do Hari Om meditation. Let's sit comfortably and easily, and close your eyes. Let's take our attention to the base of the spine. Take a deep breath in. Hari Breathe in and move on to the second chakra, just four inches above the base of the spine. Hari.
Breathing. Come to your navel center, navel region. Breathe in and come to your chest region near the heart. Breathing and come to the throat region.
Relax and let go all your efforts. You are nothing and do nothing. Breathe in, take your attention to in between the eyebrows. Let's take our attention to the top of the head. Breathe in. And breathe out. Once again. Relax and let go all your efforts. 
Repose in yourself with a smile. Relax and let go of all your efforts. Peace and joy showering on you right this moment. Feel the peace and the grace. Relax and move. And slowly and gradually become aware of body and surroundings. If you want to stretch, you can stretch. With a smile on your face, like a baby, you may open your eyes.